As exciting as it is to move into a new home, not many people actually look forward to the moving day. Whether you're moving across town or across the country, moving is stressful. Here are some helpful hints from expert movers to make the big day a little more bearable. And just so you know, I speak with a little bit of experience as I've moved approximately 18 times in my life. Number one, schedule your move well ahead of time. Moving companies get booked weeks in advance, if not months. And you want to ensure that they have a truck that fits all of your belongings. Number two, consider having the moving company do the packing for you. If it's within your budget to hire packers, it may be money well spent. Number three, schedule services. Don't forget to have services such as gas and electricity transferred or started at your new home. Number four, have your new home professionally cleaned. Even if the seller does a cleaning prior to closing, arrange to have it done before you move in so that you will arrive at a home that meets your expectations. Number five, pack a moving supply box. Your moving supply box should contain items that you may need while you are unpacking and getting settled in your new home. Number six, make your bed. Pack your sheets, blankets, and pillows together in well-marked boxes so you can find them easily. When you're ready to collapse at the end of the moving day, you'll be really grateful to know that your beds are ready for you to snuggle right into. Number seven, ditto for your towels and bath soap. Pack your towels and bath soap with your sheets so that you can jump into the shower after a long day of moving. Number eight, don't forget to make plans for your pets. The last thing you need on moving day is a stressed out kitty or dog, or worse yet, one that escapes into an unfamiliar neighborhood because of the stress. Number nine, say yes to helpers. Sometimes it's hard to accept extra help from family and friends, especially if you're not sure what you need them to help with. Number 10, hire a sitter. If you have little ones, make plans for someone to be with them so that you can concentrate. Number 11, hire someone to hang your art. Unless you love to hang things yourself, you might consider having a handyman scheduled to come in and hang your art or even your window treatments for you. And number 12, check out of the old house. Prior to closing, you should have submitted a mail forwarding form with Canada Post. You'll also need to remember to leave all keys, even for the side doors and the garage door openers. And make sure the movers don't pack up items such as the ceiling fan remote controls or other loose items that should stay with the house. Don't forget to clean out spaces such as the attic, backyard sheds, crawl spaces, or any other hideaway spaces that you may have stored items. Always nice to have the home professionally cleaned for the new owners. And if you feel inclined, leave a list of recommended local vendors and services. Do you need any other tips for moving or even prepping your home for the market? Call me or DM me today.